What's up guys? Welcome to today's video and welcome to 2019. 2019. Does anyone else feel like it was literally just the year 2000 and I thought that the world was going to end? Like computers were going to take over the world, the matrix was coming, and you know, now it's 2019 and... I still think the world might be ending. I'm not sure. 2018 literally was like everything was so crazy with the news, with the drama, with the YouTube drama. I mean, 2018 was a hot mess. But you know what? One of the most positive things to come out of 2018, which is the reason why we're here for today's video, guys, is I'm going to share with you the best skincare products, all of the most amazing skincare products, my holy grails, my must-haves, my recommended. In 2018, I tried so many skincare products. I mean, you guys saw them here on my channel, and I have accumulated a pile. I keep looking in front of me because I'm a little bit overwhelmed. I've got so many skincare products to share with you guys. I've seen so many best of videos like best of makeup, best of skincare, and these videos tend to get really long. So I suggest right up front, grab a snack, grab a coffee, and pull up a chair because I'm going to share with you guys all of the must-haves for 2018. Also, if I'm sounding a little bit stuffed up today, guys, I did go into 2019 with a little bit of a cold, but we are soldiering on. I'm a little bit stuffed and this year is completely deaf right now. But we are going to soldier on because I've got so many skincare products to tell you guys about. Before we go any further, if you haven't already, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button right down below. Turn on that bell notification so you don't miss a single video. Guys, we are inching closer and closer to 5,000 subscribers. I can't believe it. Thank you guys so much. Okay, let's dive right into today's video. The best skincare products of 2018. My holy grails, my must-haves, my repurchase, my recommended. Let's do it. All right, guys, so there's no other way that I could start my best skincare products of 2018 without probably my most used product, which is actually a cleansing device. Now, this is the Clarisonic Mia Fit. Facial cleansing brushes are so important. If you're not a person that uses a facial cleansing brush, whether it be a Clarisonic, a Lunaforio, Clarisonic can get your skin up to six times cleaner than just using your hands alone. And honestly, if you're someone out there who wears makeup or has any heavy buildup on their skin, a Clarisonic or a Lunaforio Oreo, a facial cleansing brush is a must. Now the Clarisonic does come with customizable brush heads and I like to keep two on stack. This is just the Gentle Radiance brush and this one is really soft and I actually prefer the Gentle Radiance brush head as my daily cleanser but I do like to keep a second brush head on deck and this is actually the sensitive brush head and you might think that because it's for sensitive skin or the sensitive setting that it's soft and it is soft, but it's definitely not as soft as the Gentle Radiance brush head. So I like to use the Sensitive brush head around the nose region, along the forehead and the chin, and the Gentle Radiance brush I use all over. So I like to use my Clarisonic just once a day. I go really gently, just lightly brush it over the skin. I actually saw Clarisonic's most recent ad where they placed a Clarisonic on top of an egg yolk. Yeah, on top of an egg yolk and they like moved it around and they were like it's literally gentle enough for an egg yolk so it's gentle enough for your skin if you're not using a facial cleansing brush going into 2019 what are you even doing pause this video go get one and then come back now the next product i have been la 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 loving in 2018 one that i repurchased many times guys this is bosha's exfoliating peel gel and this is a lightweight peel gel that gently exfoliates for a deeply purified and radiant looking skin now i'm not joking you guys i'm the king of exfoliation i have used every literally every exfoliator every chemical exfoliator every physical exfoliator Probably for the last 10 years, I have been like the exfoliator king, testing and trying them all. And I am telling you guys that the Bosha Exfoliating Peel Gel is among the best of the best, if not the best. Now, the reason you should be using a chemical exfoliator is because they're actually more gentle on the skin. This is just a really lightweight gel. You put a couple pumps on your fingers, just kind of spread it around the face, and then you start to rub in tiny circles. And guys, your skin literally starts to peel and ball off. I know there's a little bit of confusion. I know there is an ingredient in these peeling gels that ultimately balls up on itself. So there's a little bit of misleading science in there between is that balling up skin? Is it product? All I can say is that I notice huge benefits every time I use this peeling gel, especially in my nose. You guys know I say this all the time. I have a lot of dirt, a lot of buildup. I have big pores in my nasal region guys and I have to really exfoliate every couple days to get rid of that dry skin. I've got texture on my forehead and the Bosha exfoliating peel gel has really been a total lifesaver last year. Now that's not to say that I don't mind totally all physical exfoliators. Exfoliators have their time, their place. You know, if I forget to do a chemical exfoliation and I'm in the shower, that's when I'll pick up a little bit of a physical exfoliator, throw it on the nose, just kind of do a little boop de boo and done. So both exfoliators have their place and time, but if I only had to recommend one for like ever and ever, amen, 
the Boccia Exfoliating Peel Gel. And one of the best things other than the product actually working is that it has Sephora's Clean at Sephora logo, which means that it's free of phthalates, parabens, sulfates, I mean, all that nasty stuff, coal tar, because for some reason they still put coal tar in ingredients. The fact that it works and it has the Clean at Sephora logo, what more can I tell you guys? Now, in 2018, I tried so many serums, you guys. So many serums. Vitamin C serums, vitamin A, elemental P. I have tried every serum that you could possibly imagine in the last year. And one serum in particular really stood out to me. Now, this is Claire's Rich Moist Soothing Serums basic essentials moisturizing and soothing care now the thing that i love most about this serum in particular is it actually has ingredients in there that lower the temperature of your skin so if you're someone who gets red skin inflamed skin irritated skin this is an amazing soothing hydrating serum and i just love that it was so hydrating i mean it really just goes on the skin in almost like a cocoon it goes into the skin it sinks in deep and your skin feels so luxurious so hydrated so plump a lot of the other serums that I tried this year, I just found really sat on top of the skin, and I did see benefits from these other serums, but what I like in a serum is that hydration, that really deep, that first layer of moisture, and I just found that this serum in particular really gave me that comfort, that soothing, that moisture, and it just turned out to be one of my all-time favorite serums literally one of my all-time favorite serums. I actually would compare this to Dior has one with a similar texture and the Dior serum is literally like a hundred dollars and this one is around 30 bucks. So after washing my skin, toning, it is ready to absorb some of this serum and just let me show you guys. I'll just show you how it's kind of like sticky. See it really just clings to the skin, hydrates the skin and oh you guys it's so amazing. I'm just obsessed with this serum for the price, for the benefits, for what it did to my skin. This is definitely a serum that I would recommend you guys pick up, test out, try out. I am loving this video because all of these products I just feel so passionate about. Now, if you've been following my channel for the last year, this next product is going to be no surprise to you. This is the L'Oreal Paris Hydrogenius for Oily Skin. This is an everyday moisturizer. This is, I think, my third bottle. I've got two more bottles under the sink literally a total of five bottles. This is a daily moisturizer. It's so lightweight. It's for oily skin. It really mattifies the skin. It has aloe water. It has three different types of hyaluronic acid, literally 72 hours of moisture. I've seen it retail anywhere from $10 to $20. Depends what drugstore you're at, but it is an amazing moisturizer. I used this. Oh, I just squirted it all over my hand. I actually just set the lid off to the side. Go figure. Mm, but it smells so good. I used this moisturizer all last year. I even bought it for family and friends for different events, different gifts. I mean, I haven't been this obsessed with a moisturizer in a really long time. Honestly, the price just gets me. The product works so well. It hydrates the skin, but it doesn't leave you oily. This moisturizer really helped to control my oil while hydrating my skin. I mean, literally, it sounds too good to be true. Now, I wouldn't say that it's the best moisturizer for winter because it is pretty lightweight. It's a gel serum, so really it would be good for spring, summer, that's when I really loved it. And it's so cost effective that I would use just so many pumps. Oh, I would lather it up, I'd take it down my neck, behind my ears, and my skin would just be hydrated all day long. Absolutely incredible, definitely worth picking up, definitely worth trying out. Drugstore moisturizer, you don't need to be spending $100 on like a little 50 mils of moisturizer. Check out the drugstore guys, try out different products, see which ones work for you. It is all about results, not about price, not about brand name, not about marketing. It is about results, I'm about results, and I'm loving it. Now, the next product that I absolutely loved last year in 2018 has actually been a staple in my skincare routine for a couple of years, maybe five years. I think I need to start talking about it more here on my channel and start recommending it more to you guys. This is the Origins Drink Up Intensive Overnight Mask to Quench Skin's Thirst. Now, I've used this overnight mask, like I said, literally for years, and I try so many other overnight masks, and this one, A, not only has 4.5 stars, out of five at Sephora. Literally everyone loves this mask, but I've tried so many overnight masks. This one is the most hydrating, hands down, the most hydrating, the most quenching. When you wake up the next morning after using this overnight mask, your skin feels like silk. Now the formula of this face mask is ultra rich. It contains apricot oil, seaweed, Japanese seaweed, and I'm telling you guys now I use the Bosha overnight mask, which I love, the Laneige overnight mask, which is very light compared to this one. I've tried 
so many different overnight masks and this one ultra luxurious so rich so hydrating this is actually the overnight face mask that i travel with the most every time i go to las vegas you guys know it is so dry there between the hotels between the desert the air in las vegas is just so dry every time i go this is the face mask the only overnight face mask that i will bring and in my old life when i used to go in the sun and i used to suntan i used to use this face mask after sun exposure I can't believe I'm saying this, but I used to use this overnight and it would really hydrate the skin because you know when you're in the sun, your skin gets so dehydrated. Don't ever go in the sun, but if you do go in the sun, this is the best overnight mask to use because it's really hydrating, really quenching. And I'm gonna start to talk about this more because as a staple in my skincare routine for years, this is a total holy grail. Now, another skincare product that I totally loved last year that really comforted my skin, hydrated my skin, nourished my skin, and honestly just gave me like the best radiant glow ever. This is Dear Claire's Freshly Juiced Vitamin E Mask boosting radiance and glow. Now, I'm almost done my first container and I already went ahead and ordered my second container. Now, you guys know I've talked about this here on my channel. This is a jelly mask. It does contain a healthy dose of vitamin E. And if you're using a vitamin C serum, vitamin E actually works to nourish that vitamin C and help it absorb into the skin and work even more effectively. Now, this product is actually marketed as an overnight mask, but it is lightweight enough to use as a daily moisturizer. And that's exactly how I used it. I used it every single morning and it actually kind of mattified my skin, smoothed my skin out. If you can imagine kind of like that silicone or like a dimethicone finish and it just applied so beautifully to the skin and gave such a nice radiance, a nice glow. Honestly, look, it's this is almost gone and I started to panic when it got down there. I was like, I've got to get my hands on another one. This does have such a heavy dose of vitamin E, which is known to slow down the aging of cells because it's such a powerful antioxidant. Vitamin E is just amazing to add into your skincare routine and the instant benefits and the long-term benefits that I saw with this lightweight moisturizer, honestly, obsessed. Not only does the vitamin E mask help to protect against free radicals, it also helps to protect your skin against UV damage. Sign me up, let's apply this to my whole body. If any of you guys out there right now are thinking, oh my gosh, this is so many products, he's telling me about so many things, don't worry, I'm gonna have all of these products linked in the description box down below. If you've tried any of these products, also let me know in the comments down below which ones you love, which ones you've tried, but let's keep going because I've got a bunch more products to tell you guys about. Now, the star of my overnight moisturizers last year was absolutely none other than the Clinique Turnaround Overnight Revitalizing Moisturizer. If you've been following my channel for the last year, you guys know this is my all-time favorite overnight moisturizer. I've tried so many overnight moisturizers, and this Clinique one is actually similar to another one that I really like. I don't have it here, but Bliss has an overnight cream very similar to the Clinique Overnight Cream. This contains salicylic acid, so it's actually gonna help to remove the skin, exfoliate the skin at the same time as it deeply nourishes, hydrates the skin. Honestly, I would say that this is so hydrating. This is pretty similar to an overnight mask. It's not as sticky though, and it absorbs into the skin. So one of the problems with an overnight mask is it does leave your skin sticky, and I have a cat, and my cat sleeps on my bed, so you can picture what happens literally stickiness all over my face. But an overnight moisturizer doesn't have that stickiness. It has more of a dry down feel. So if you're not someone who likes that tackiness or that stickiness, especially against your pillowcase, pick up this overnight moisturizer. I will almost guarantee you that you absolutely love it. Honestly, when I use this Clinique overnight moisturizer, which is probably a couple times a week, because I alternate between overnight masks, it just depends what my skin is looking for. But I'm telling you guys, hydration, plump, smooth skin, all in one product while you sleep. Seems like a no brainer. Now, next up is a sunscreen. Sunscreen is the most important skincare product of 2018, of 2017, of 2016, of 2019, 20, 21, and 22. And for the rest of infinity, sunscreen is the bomb. Now, last year in particular, I really took on sun protection. I took it on to a whole new level, and I've got two sunscreens here, two sunscreens that I'm totally obsessed with last year. And the first sunscreen we're going to talk about is Color Science Sun Forgettable Loose Mineral Sunscreen. Now, let me tell you all about this all mineral sunscreen with literally the easiest applicator of all time. It makes applying sunscreen so easy. And it even has a little bit of a tint, so it provides a little bit of coverage, a little bit of flawlessness. I mean, you guys, look at this. The SPF just comes right out of this brush. And the reason that I'm so obsessed with this, 
A, because it's absolutely amazing, full of coverage, a PA of four pluses. So you are getting total protection with this sunscreen. But what I love most is that it's so convenient. You just pull this right up, you pop the lid on right in your pocket. So this makes reapplying so easy. I like to keep this in my jacket pocket. I keep it in my car. I bring it around with me. I mean, what could be more easy and more convenient? And being able to reapply sunscreen is key in sun safety. So literally, look how easy this is. I can't. It's also going to give you pollution defense, and if you live in a big city, pollution defense is amazing on your skin. It's also going to protect against blue light from TVs, cell phones, laptops, I mean, you name it. It's also going to protect you against infrared light. So this is pretty much a full spectrum protection. Really, there is no reason why you shouldn't be using this. It's so great. Now, if you're not into powdered sunscreens, don't worry guys, because there is another sunscreen that I fell in love with last year, and I actually did an entire review, a whole standalone video on this sunscreen. It transformed my entire views on sunscreen. This is the Dear Claire's Soft Airy UV Essence Everyday Sun Protector. It's lightweight, it's invisible, there is zero white cast, it has an SPF 50 plus PA 4 plus ratings, just like the color science, and this sunscreen is water-based, gel texture, literally zero white cast. Let me just show you guys on the back of my hand here. I'm going to apply, look, I'll even apply like a liberal amount. Can you guys see this? I'm going to rub it in zero 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 white cast come on camera can you guys see that it also contains no additives and is green level safe it's amazing you know dear claire's just uses really simple but effective ingredients in all of their skincare products so what i like to do is my morning application of sunscreen is use the claire's soft air uv essence all over my skin really get that nice liquid coating i get behind my ears my neck totally do that whole kit and caboodle and then i'll use the color science as a touch up and that really gives me a good first layer a good base layer of uv protection and then i'll use the color science on the go in the car in my pocket to make sure that i am never without uv protection all right guys we made it to the last my final holy grail product of 2018 if you've been following me since last year this is absolutely going to be zero 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 surprise to anybody. Last year, I fell in love with the Clarins Instant Light Lip Comfort Oil. Now, you guys might be asking, Trevor, a lip oil? This is not only a lip oil, guys. This is a life-transforming, life-altering lip product. I'm just going to go ahead and apply a little bit, you guys. Oh my goodness. This lip oil is absolutely life-changing. I can't tell you the last time that I wore this out and didn't get a compliment on my juicy, luxurious lips. People are always like, whoa, what is on your lips? This is lightweight, non-sticky. I mean, look, nothing. You get nothing but perfect, gloss, plump, luscious, juicy lips. I mean, what more could you ask for? Now, I do have to say that this lip oil is $25. Last year, I did buy four of them. I spent $100 on lip oil, and I don't care. I don't care, you guys. If I can justify any expense, $100 on lip oil, because of what it's done for my life, I mean, can you really put a price on that? Like, when I apply this along my lips, I'm not just applying lip oil. Like, I'm literally feeling all my dreams come true. I can't explain it. If any of you guys have tried this lip oil, let me know in the comments down below. Life-changing, amazing, beautiful, the package. I can't go on. I have used this lip oil exclusively for a full year. No other brands because honestly, I don't ever need to try another brand ever again. You guys know that Clarins holds a very special place in my heart and I used to love the Clarins toner. Not that I don't love it anymore, but I've just tried other products. I've branched out. I've expanded into different horizons, but this is just a little piece of Clarins that I think I'm going to hang on to. I'm going to keep in my back pocket. Clarins, you do hold such a special place in my heart really the reason why I fell in love with skincare in the beginning. So this means a little bit more to me than just a lip oil. It kind of brings back a lot of memories to the brand and I just love it. And that guys is a look back on all of the best skincare products that I have been loving in 2018. Now I can't recommend any of these products any more than I recommend them. I tested them, I've tried them, I've repurchased them. They are holy grails, transforming 
products, I mean. These are all skincare products that I just needed to share with you guys one last time before we totally let go of 2018. Now I feel like we can totally let go of 2018 open up and welcome in more beautiful products. I am so excited to test and try new products for you guys in 2019. Later this week, I've got a video coming, the top skincare trends to look forward to in 2019, and there are some crazy trends. So keep your eyes peeled for that video because we are looking toward the future and the future is brighter than ever. If you've tried any of the products in today's video, let me know in the comments down below if you're gonna pick any of them up, if you try them out, come back and let me know. I love to talk to you guys. I love to meet you guys. If you made it to the end of this video, you are so, so special to me. Thanks for sticking around until the very end. Thanks for being a part of this growing family. And I hope you have the most positive, fulfilling, happy 2019 wishes from me to you. Oh, I literally just got the goosebumps thinking about you guys. I really wish you the best in 2019. Health, happiness. Until the next video, guys, I can't wait to see you then. Bye, guys. Oh, I literally just got goosebumps.